Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today I am here with the next game in Arizona in the Arizona Wranglers Sportsman Z League um, schedule. And as you can see, today we play at home against the Philadelphia Eagles, who, if you will recall, in game two of the season, we beat 30 to 27 in basically on, I think it was the last play of the game or right near the very end of the game, uh, we put it away. So without further ado, let's get on with this game. We will uh, play the week. Play one week. You got those results rolling in. So we come in seven and five, and the Eagles are eight and four in their um, on their side of the league. And it's going to be the top two. I never, I don't know if I mentioned this, but it'll be the top two in each division will make the uh, playoffs. So we are a game out of, or a game and a half. Is it a game and a half? No, we're, uh, yeah, we're two games out of being able to be in that group. So, so we gotta, we gotta make up some ground here. But uh, anyway, that begins with us trying to beat, we're gonna, I'm gonna defer the kickoff. And that begins with us trying to beat um, Philadelphia. The last time it was a struggle. So hopefully it's an easier, we have an easier time of it today. Philadelphia will start at their, um, At their 31, or no, they're, they're, they're 26, sorry. And we don't get them before they get the first down. So they do get the first down. Gonna look run again. They pass again, my luck. So they get another first down. All right, I'm gonna guess the pass. And now they run. But we did stop them, so I'm going to guess pass again. They've got a second and 10 at their 46. And it's incomplete. And I am definitely going to put in the dime, and we're going to go with the pass. And it looks like it was incomplete. So they got a fourth and 10 at their 46, and we're going to put in the punt return uh, alignment. And I'm going to try to catch the ball because we're too far in our own territory. So we're going to start at the 10. Um, Going with the pro set, going with the flat pass. I know there's people out there that are like, you know, you, you flat pass too much. But with Landry, that's the bread and butter. And I don't know what happened there. What I guess it was complete for a yard. So that doesn't really help a lot. Uh, we're going to go flat pass to the halfback. I'm going to go to the halfback this time. And that's incomplete. All right, so now we got to go short. I mean, there's just no doubt about that. We're going to go short to the flanker. And they're, it looks like they're offsides. And I am going to accept the penalty for sure. So that gives us a third and six at the 14. I'm still going to go short, though, because we really can't be... Um, and it's complete. Nice. So we got a first and 10 at the Arizona 25. I'm going to do a look in to the tight end. Incomplete. Let's go and run with the halfback. Spencer. Spencer out of Ohio State. Tim Spencer. 
I don't think they were looking for that. He got eight yards on it. So we got a third and two. This time I'm going to go line buck with the fullback. And he gets the first down. Nice. That's all I really wanted. And we're going to go back to the uh, pro set. I'm going to go flat to the tight end. We got to go back to the bread and butter and keep trying to nail the bread and butter. And it's not going to work. It's incomplete. So let's go and run again then. See if, he, uh, if Tim Spencer can break a big one. And they're offsides again. And I am going to accept it. We're loving the fact that uh, that uh, Philadelphia keeps making penalties. So now we've got a second and five at the Arizona 42. I'm going to go off tackle with Spencer. And he gets the first down. And again, that's all. That's the name of the game. Get the first downs. All right, I'm going to start out with a short to the flanker here. And it's incomplete. Second and 10 at the Arizona 48. I'm going to launch it. I'm going to go. I'm going to go launching. Let's see what happens. Let's see if that works. It won't. He just overthrows it. So we got a third and 10. You know what? I'm going end run. No, I'm not. I guess I'm not. I'm not even doing any kind of run. All right. So let's go short to the wide receiver. I guess you can't run. And it's a first down. Nice. They forced me into it, and I and I did it, and it got the first down. First and 10 at the 41. Let's go draw play with the halfback. Let's change it up a little bit. I don't think they were looking for that. He got five yards there. We got a second and five at the Philadelphia 36. Let's go end run with the halfback, Spencer. And he almost got the first down, but not quite. But we still got a third and one. So I'm going to go line buck with the fullback. And he gets the first down and just a tad more. And that's fine. That's what we need. Keep the chains moving. First and 10 at the, tw at the Philadelphia 28. I'm going to go, I'm going to try to launch this in and see if we can come up with a quick surprise touchdown. Maybe, and it is. He throws a long pass for a touchdown. So we're going to kick the extra point. I think we caught Philadelphia maybe flat footed there. All right, so we're going to kick off. Seven nothing. We got a good seven nothing lead with 425 left in the first half. And I am going to put in the balanced to begin with. And uh, he's going to be off to the races with that. Got 13 yards on it. So we're going to put in the run. Going to change up the look. And it doesn't help because it's actually a pass. But it's incomplete. So second and 10 for Philadelphia at their 38. I'm going to put in the pass again. Wentz looking and he hitting his man and he's going to hit his man for a long gainer. And we finally do stop him. But not until he gets to the uh, to our 28. So I'm going to be looking for the pass. And that's what he's doing. And we'd stop him short of the first down, but only just barely short. I'm going to put in the pass again. I guess they're dedicated to the pass. But we do stop him in the backfield, even though um, that was uh, 
um, that was a run play. So uh, he's got a third and four at the Arizona 22. I'm going to still look at, looking for the pass. And it's incomplete. So let's see. He'll probably kick the field goal. I'm going to put in just general kick defense. And he does. And he makes the field goal, but it's 7-3 to three, uh, still. So we're going, they're kicking off. Minute 26 still left in the first quarter. The first quarter seems to never go very quickly. I'm going to uh, take for a touchback. And we're going to go flat pass to the halfback. And there's a, uh, there's a flag on the play. If I accept the penalty, it'll be my ball on the Arizona 44. If I decline it, it's going to be my ball in the 29. Well, I'm going to, I'm going to accept the penalty. I mean, if you know me, usually I like to give the play to the guy, but um, not in this case. So end run with the halfback, Tim Spencer. Ah, he got stopped quickly there. One yard, just a one yard gain. We're going back to the pro set, though. I'm not going to do blocking back. Uh, let's go look in pass to the tight end on second and 11. And he catches it, and he's all, he almost got the first down. Not quite, but we only have a third and one. So I'm going to go off tackle with the halfback. And he got stopped in the backfield. All right. Um, fourth and one, I'm not punting. No, sir. I'm going to go line buck with the fullback. Did he get the first down? Yes, he did. First and 10 for us at the 46. So that's all I cared about. Look in pass to the halfback. And he catches it, I think. Yeah, for four yards. So we got a second and six at the Philadelphia 42. Pro set. I'm going to go draw play halfback. There is a flag on the play, but it was on us, looks like. So we got a second and six at the Philadelphia 42. I'm going to go flat pass. I'm going back to my flat, flat to the tight end. And it looks like it was incomplete. So we've got a third and six. Yeah. Third and six, let's go short to the wide receiver. Bugs. And it's incomplete. Man. All right, fourth and six um, at the Philadelphia 42. Man. Yeah, I'm going to punt. You got to punt. I mean, I love going for fourth downs. If you know me, if you've watched some of the past games, you know I love to go for. Uh, for fourth downs, but not here. And then it goes into the end zone, so he's going to have it for a touchback. Um, yeah, and I'm going to go looking for the pass because that's all they're really doing. And when they do run, they're they're unsuccessful, even if I'm not looking for the run. That time they were successful, though. They got a second and one at their 29. I'm going to put in the pass defense. Wentz looking, looking, and we stop him right when he catches the ball, but he did catch it, so they got a first down. First and 10 for Philadelphia at the 34. I'm going to put in the pass. And it's complete, is it? Yeah, for a yard. So they got a second and nine. I'm going to put in the pass again. And it's complete, is it? Yeah. Minus one yard, though. 
So now they got a third and 10 at the 34. Definitely, I'm guessing, pass on this one. And that's going to be incomplete, I think. So they're they're going to they're going to punt. So we've held them. Definitely, I'm going to catch the ball and run with it. And we only get a few yards there. Going back to the pro set, that's my bread and butter. Let's go to the end run with a halfback. And we get a couple of yards there, three yards, so. I'm going back to the pro set. 8.58 left in the second quarter, or basically in the half. Off tackle with the halfback. And he gets a few yards there again, two yards. So we've got a second and seven. Second and seven, I'm still going to go flat. I'm going to go flat to the flanker, though. And he gets the first down, nice. So first and 10 at the Arizona 45. I'm gonna do a look in pass to the split end. And that looks like it was complete for five yards. It was second and five at the uh, at midfield. I'm gonna go end run with the halfback keep this Philadelphia team off balance and he gets three yeah so we got a third and two at the Philadelphia 47 uh, I'm gonna go line buck with the halfback because I'm thinking in terms of a fourth down at that situation but he's but he got it anyway so we have a first and ten at the Philadelphia 43. I'm going to go flat to the halfback Spencer. And he catches it and he gets some yards too. Four yards. So we got a second and six at the Philadelphia 39. And I'm going to go off tackle with the fullback on second and six. And I don't think they expected that at all. And he gets the first down easy. And now we have a first and 10 at the Philadelphia 25. And I'm going end run with a halfback. And it looks like he's going to get to the outside, but he only gets a yard or two. No, he gets four. All right, four yards. I'll take that. I didn't seem like he got that many. Second and six at the Philadelphia 21. I am going to go. This is where I'm going to break out the short pass. See if I can throw it, you know, close to the end zone or into the end zone. And it is complete. And he does. He's 10 yards away now. We're 10 yards away. First and goal to Philadelphia 10. I'm going to do it again. I'm going to go short this time to the split end. Johnson. And it's a touchdown for Arizona. And we're going to kick the field goal or the extra point. And it's going to be 14 to 3. And he doesn't really have a lot of time left either. And remember, we get the ball to lead off the second half. But they had a great return there. We must have terrible special teams. Um, so they got a first and 10 at their 35. But I'm looking past because we're getting down to it now. And he catches it, but we stop him right there. And I'm looking past again. 
And we stop them quickly on the run, even though we weren't looking for it. Third and four, we're looking past. And that's incomplete. So he's got a punt, and we're putting in the punt return for sure. We may even, I, I mean, <clears throat> it's going to be tough, but we might be able to get a, something. Got to return it. No, I'm gonna. I'm. Uh, I'm gonna let the ball bounce. I didn't want to take a chance on a turnover right there with a minute 52 left and give him the ball right on our doorstep. I mean that would have been stupid. So let's go flat to the split end, and it is caught, and he does get uh, some yards there, five yards. I'm not going to put in any, I'm not going to like uh, call timeouts because it's not really likely that we're going to score from as far away as we are. And there is a penalty on us. So we got a second and 11 at our six. See what I'm saying? I'm going to go off tackle with Long, the fullback. I'm just trying to eat some time. They weren't looking for it, so we got a few yards. Got a third and six. <clears throat> I'm going to go short to the wide receiver, Bugs. And that guy always seems to catch the ball when I throw to him. And he did, but he didn't give him any yards. So we are going to punt. And now there's only 52 seconds left in the half. And they catch it and they stop right there. So, and definitely we are looking for the pass. He's got a first and 10 at our 44 though. And of course, you know, the computer makes everybody beeline it for the sidelines when you're this close to the end of the game or the half, so. And we catch him in bounds, though. So he's got a first and 10 at the 26. He probably has at least another field goal right here. But if we can hold him to where he only gets the field goal. And uh, we're off sides. So that's not good. He's got a first and five at the Arizona 21. Again, we really only just have to stop him from getting a touchdown. In my mind, at least. And we, we got him in bounds, so he's got eight seconds left, and he's going to kick the field goal. So, yeah, we might as well put in kick block. There was an offside or penalty there on somebody. And they are going to do an onside kick that doesn't work. So that will be the end of the half. With us leading 14 to 6. All right, we're back for the second half. And I do have a little explaining to do to you. So let's uh, get on with the explanation. As you can see... The score, maybe you can't see because this is in the way. But anyway, right now the score is actually 14-7. to 7. We are leading 14-7 instead of 14-6. Hey, what happened? And the reason for that is that I have a problem with my computer right now where the RAM doesn't allow for, for me to uh, record an entire um, football game. So I had to do it one half at a time. Well, I did do it one half at a time. I uh, minimized the game after the first half, and then I um, took the first half uh, video out of the screencast-o-matic and put it on the desktop so that we would have more room. But what happened when I did that was that the, um, the game ended up um, being 
not um, like it was, it was in that, you know, that white area where it's not really saving and it asked me if I wanted to continue to save it and I tried to do that, but it didn't. So what I ended up having to do was quick play the first half and get it as close as I could get it to what actually happened in the real first half, if that makes any sense. And um, so what ended up happening was when I got a, when I got the, um, when I, I won the flip and I kicked off and then I quick played it and the score was 14 to seven instead of 14 to six. And we have a third and one here. I decided that that was as close as I was going to get and, you know, to not have to keep playing it and playing it and playing it until I got a 14 to six um, result. And we're gonna get caught in the backfield. I don't know, fourth and two, you know what? I'm not gonna punt. I'm gonna go pro set and I'm gonna flat pass to the tight end. He would better catch it this time. And he won't. So I'm turnover on downs. That deep in the territory. I took a chance there. So anyway, I apologize for the screw up. It's my stupid computer. It doesn't have the RAM. For all of a sudden, it doesn't have the RAM to, to store an entire game. So I end up having to do, you know, to, to record parts of games or in the case of football or record only, like with the baseball, I can only record one baseball game and then I have to and then I have to save that game and then I have to go on from there. So, and he's got a third and six from the Arizona 25. If I can stop him here, I got a good chance. Cause this wouldn't be a gimme and it is, it's incomplete. So let's see if he can make it. He's definitely gonna try it. So I'm sorry for that, but I did get as close to the score, the actual score that we had from the first half as I could get. Now, obviously, I quick played the first half of this game. So when you watch the game, you're going to be seeing, and he does make the field goal, so it's 14 to 10. So you're going to be seeing the actual first half that I played and had on video, which won't match up with, this, with the actual score of the real first half, but it's close. It's 14 to seven instead of 14, six. So, um, all right, so first and 10, I'm gonna go short to the split end. I think as far as the integrity of the game, it, it still holds true. In fact, it, we're given, we gave the uh, Eagles a point, but they were still within a touchdown if they did the two point conversion, so. Um, I don't think that it was really that big of a deal, but I figured that's as close as I'm going to get. And that was the, that was a second attempt too. The first attempt, it was something like nine, seven Philadelphia on a quick play. So with everything that happened, me winning the toss and deferring to the second half and, um, and we had 14 points just like we actually did and they only had uh, seven instead of six i figured that's yeah he's sacked so i figured that was as close as we're going to get and uh so we'll see if we end up losing by a point you can blame me but more more specifically you can blame the uh computer and the lack of ram so that was a great punt though. So he's got a first and 10 at his own 41. I'm gonna be looking for the pass. I'm gonna be looking for the pass again on second and two. And he is, he is passing on second and two. And I think it's incomplete. So it's third and two. I'm definitely going to look for the pass, but he could go, it could go either way. And we stopped him. So he'll probably punt. Yes, he does. 
For some reason, the guy, the Eagles cannot, the 2018 Eagles cannot run the ball. I don't know what the deal is with that, but. I am going to try to run with it. And he just gets met right there, and that's it. I'm going to go short. I'm going to start out with a short pass to the flanker. And he catches it for the first down. Nice. Got to keep those chains moving. Going to go end run with Spencer. I'm going to go. So second and eight. I'm going to go flat pass to the split end. And he's within two yards. So we've got a third and two. I, you know, I got to go, I got to still go to the flat pass, but we're going to go flat to the tight end. And he doesn't catch it. I can't believe this. I'm not doing it. I'm not punting. I'm not punting with two yards to go. I'm going to go flat to the uh, flanker. I mean, we only got to get two yards. And he does catch it. Nice. Gamble paid off. Got a first and 10 at the Arizona 44. Going to go end run, halfback. Ah, he's caught way in the backfield there. Second and 13, let's go short. I mean, we got to get out of this um, hole that we dug ourselves. And he catches it for a first down. Love it. All right, so uh, first and 10 at the Philadelphia 45. Going to go look in pass to the flanker. And they, I think they were off sides. And yeah, we're going to accept the penalty. You know that. So we got a first and five at the Philadelphia 40. I'm going line buck with the fullback. And he gets right back to the line, I think. One yard, he got one yard. So we got a second and four at the Philadelphia 39. I'm gonna go look into the flanker. And somebody had a penalty. Let's hope it's Philadelphia again. Let's really hope that. I'm gonna decline it, because uh, I like to take the play when I can. I don't even care what the result was. I knew it was a first down. So we got a first and 10 at the Philadelphia 27. We're going to go end run with Spencer. And he gets one, maybe, maybe nothing, no gain. So we got a second and 10 at the Philadelphia 27. I'm going to go off tackle. I'm going to go off tackle with the fullback. That guy is getting some yards today. And he gets a few there, but not a lot, just three yards. So we got a third and seven. I'm going to go short to the uh, wide receiver, Douglas. Incomplete. Fourth and seven, I'm going to kick the field goal, but he probably isn't going to make it. That would be my guess, and he doesn't. If you've been following the season, you know Frank Corral is okay at um, kicking extra points, but he's terrible at kicking field goals. So uh, there's a penalty on the play, but it's on us. So it's first and five for Philadelphia at the 36. Minute 51 left on the third quarter. This game could end up being as close as the first one was. P 
pass. We're going to put in the pass. Hopefully I can figure out the thing with the RAM, the lack of RAM or um, or something or or just not have the, the game go into that um, no man's land of trying to save it but not being able to save it. So we tackle Wentz on a bootleg. He's got a third and five. And I can figure that out before the next game because in a lot of cases, you're not going to, I mean, I was fortunate that I was able to come up with a result that was cl very close to what the actual result was. I'm going to go balanced, even though that doesn't seem to work a lot. And we sacked him. Nice. So he tried it and it didn't work for him. He went for the fourth and two and he didn't work out for him. 14.43 left. We're ahead 14-10. I'm going to go short to the flanker. I'm going to start right out trying to get down into that territory. See, he was in our territory, so all right, it's incomplete. I'm going to go off tackle with the halfback. He won't be looking for it, but he still only got like four yards there yeah third and six philadelphia 46 i'm gonna go flat to the tight end i know this is not likely to get me six yards but i gotta try and did he catch it he did and i got a fourth and one there's no way i'm punting you know me i'm not punting on that I'm going line buck with Spencer. And he gets the first down and a little more. So we got a first and 10 at the Philadelphia 37. New lease on life. Let's go flat to the tight end. And it's incomplete. Second and 10 at the 37. I'm going to try the end run with the halfback, Spencer. And he gets only like two yards, yeah. So we got a third and eight. I'm pretty much going to have to go short to the flanker. Hopefully, it, the penalty is on him, hopefully. No, it was on us, third and 18. I'm going to go to the spread, and uh, we're going to go long to the flanker. Going to be incomplete. So we got a third and 18 at the Philadelphia 45. Really, that just gives us more room for the punt. I suppose. And we hemmed him up pretty, uh, pretty nice there. He's got a first and 10 at his 11. I'm going to look for the pass. And he's bootlegging it and he, we sacked him. So he going to have a second and 10. I'm going to go look for the pass again. And he runs it that time. Third and seven. I'm going to do the, uh, I'm going to do the linebacker blitz. Ah, he got the first down and he's going to get a lot more. So now he's got a first and 10 at the Philadelphia 37. I guess a, his computer says guess run. I guess I'll guess run. But he doesn't, he's not running. But it's incomplete. We were lucky there. So we're going to look for the pass. 9-12 left in the game. 
And we stop him short of the first down. That's interesting. Third and one, I'm going to look for the pass. And he does complete it. So he's got a first and 10 at midfield. He is in a situation where he's got to get a touchdown. And there's a penalty on somebody, hopefully on him, but maybe not because they're letting him play. Oh, wait, I'm going to accept the penalty. Yeah, he's got a first and 20 now at the 40. Got to back him up. I mean, that's now it's all about field position. And uh, I guess he threw a pass, but it didn't get many yards. In fact, it lost a yard. So uh, he's got a second and 21. Going to definitely look for the pass. Now there is only 7.23 left in the game, and we intercepted it. I'm going to try to gain some yards. And that was a sweet decision because, uh, <laughs> oh, we got a touchdown. Nice. Interception return for a touchdown. And I am going to kick the extra point. Yes. So it turns out it looks like even giving Philadelphia an extra point coming into the second half than they actually would have had if I was able to save the first half game. And that was another thing. That was an, another mistake I made. I didn't save the game. I probably could have, although my experience has been with Stratomatic, at least with the baseball, that if you save the game, that doesn't really do anything because the game isn't really saved. Um, at least when I play myself at home. Uh, but maybe, so maybe I should have done it and it might have worked. But I mean, really, we gave, if anything, I'm going to accept the penalty. If anything, we gave Philadelphia a bit more of an advantage. So it's not like if you're out there and you're a Philadelphia fan, and you want to see Philadelphia win this game, that you can say, I. I cheated or anything and hurt your team's chances because I actually made your team's chances better. And he runs the ball. I don't know. 517 left and now he's down by 11 points. I mean, that's brutal. He's got a second and three. I'm looking past. Or a third and two. Third and two. And we caught him inside the... Uh, No, first and ten at the yeah, first and ten at the thirty at the Arizona thirty-nine, and it's an incomplete pass. But it will be weird, I admit. It's going to be weird looking at two halves that really weren't the same for what ends up being one game. And that's another thing: this is the stats for the game, the official stats when I show the stats are going to be from this game, from this entire game. None of the stat, the actual statistics from the half that I actually televised will be in the game. And he's got a fourth and 15, man, this is sweet. So the stats aren't going to match up, but we never did check the stat. And we sack him on top of everything. All right, well. I mean, now we're playing with house money, so let's go long to the flanker. And there's a penalty on the play, hopefully on him. Although, I did I catch it? Accept the penalty, decline the penalty, Arizona ball on the Philadelphia 19. Yeah, I'm going to decline it because he did catch it. So we got a first and 10 at the Philadelphia 19. I am going to go end run with Spencer. And he gets caught in the backfield. I'm certainly not calling timeout. It's going to be a look-in pass to the halfback. 
And he, I think he caught it, yeah. No, it's incomplete. All right. Third and 11 at the Philadelphia 20. Going to go short to the flanker. And we'll see if we don't complete this for a first down, we'll see if Corral can make a first down. Fourth and sixth to Philadelphia 15 or a, a field goal. So I am going to try a field goal with Corral. Let's see if he can make it from the 15. And he can't. He's terrible. Terrible kicker. But it doesn't really matter. There's a minute 52 left. He's not going to get 11 points on us in, in, uh, in a minute 52. Second and 10, he didn't complete that pass. So he's got a second and 10 from his own 22. And now he's got a third down. Got to go for fourths, too. And he completes it. And we're going to stop him at the first down marker. First and 10 at the Philadelphia 32 for him. And we sack him. Sweet. I'm going to double team the flanker. Might as well double team somebody. And I think we caught him inbound, so that's good. Still down by 11, a minute 22 left, and we are looking for the pass. And he's still in his side of the field at 38. That time he got out of bounds and a first down. First and 10 at the Philadelphia 42. And we're going to put in the pass again. And we get him on a bootleg. So he's got a, but he's got a first and 10, first and 10. I didn't think he got to the first 10 down marker, but he's got a first and 10 at his own 47. Still on his side of the field with 52 seconds left. And we're going to put in the pass. And uh, he completes it and he gets into our territory. But he's got a first and 10 at the Arizona 39. That's great, but with 39 seconds left, and he's still down by 11. And he gets another first down. And this time we caught him, I think, in bounds. So he's got a second and 10 at the 24 with 22 seconds left. And now he's out of, he's out of uh, timeouts, too. And we sack him. And he's going to try to kick fourth and 19 to the 33. He's going to try to kick it. We'll just put in the kick block. I mean, I don't know if he'll make it even, but he doesn't. Now he's got a fourth and 14 because we had a penalty on the, on the kick. I mean, it, it, none of it really matters. There's one second left. And he's kicking a field goal that he knows isn't going to win the game for him. Game over, and that's it. We win the game 21 to uh, 13 because he kicked the field goal. So that's your final here. Again, I'm sorry for the computer screw up. It's a problem with the RAM. I got to try to fix it, see if I can take it maybe to the geeks or something and have it fixed. But, um, it, but it doesn't allow, it wouldn't allow me to record an entire football game. So I had to do what I did. And the solution was the best I could come up with. But that's it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke.
signing off.